How do you increase your organic reach on Facebook? This is a question marketers often ask as Facebook continues to change the algorithm and make it more difficult for us to reach our audience. Facebook remains one of the most important channels for marketers today, and it is vital that we understand what works and what doesn't. That is what we'll be talking about in this video today. Organic reach on Facebook is somewhere between one and 6%. But on my Facebook page, I figured out how to get as high as 65% organic reach. In this video, I'm gonna share some of my best tips with you for how you can get similar results. And stick around to the end, I'm gonna share with you exactly what not to do on Facebook as well. First, to get more organic reach on Facebook, we must understand what are the Facebook algorithms looking for? And that is highly engaging content. Facebook wants users to lean in and to feel good about the content that they're consuming, to have positive sentiment. Here are my four best content types for maximum organic reach. Number one, publish more video posts. Facebook wants to become the next generation digital streaming television, and they're absolutely favoring video content in the newsfeed. My recommended ratio is 70% video, 20% photos, and only 10% links. Links actually gets the lowest reach and lowest engagement on Facebook. The good news, you can still put links into your photo and video posts. Number two is Facebook Live video broadcasts. Facebook Live gets six times the engagement over regular uploaded video. You can go live maybe once a week, more if you want, but once a week would be a great start. Number three is to host more watch parties. A watch party is where you take any public video, including your own, recorded or live, and you're basically hosting it for your audience as if it's live right now. Facebook says people are 800 times more likely to comment on a watch party video than if they're watching the video solo. And remember, it's all about engagement. Facebook wants us to create more community and connection through video content. Number four is real easy. Ask simple short questions. The key here is relevancy. You could ask, where's your favorite place to go on vacation if you're a travel company, but that might not be relevant for every audience. So make it relevant to your audience. No visuals needed, no video, no image, just a simple short question and watch your audience respond. Next, let's look at my four favorite tips for increasing your organic reach. Number one, this is counterintuitive, but I want you to try posting less content. People think if they just post more volume, they'll reach more people. That's counterintuitive. It's not how the algorithm works. Facebook wants you to focus on really good quality posts and just slow down a bit. Maybe if you're posting like three a day, try one a day. You're more likely to reach your audience and get more engagement on that one post than trying to go with more volume. Tip number two, you can drive traffic from all kinds of other sources to your specific Facebook post. Every post on Facebook has its own unique link. It's the timestamp, the date and time. If you click on that, that gives you the unique URL for that post. Now you can take that link and then put it over on Twitter, on your email list, on your blog, on Instagram stories, and you're letting people know, hey, we have a new Facebook post up. And as you're sending more traffic, to your individual Facebook posts, more reach, more engagement begets more reach and more engagement. Tip number three is to integrate a messenger chatbot. People will be subscribed to receive messages from you in their messenger inbox. And you can send out reminders and updates. Let them know when you have a new video, a new post, that you're going live on Facebook and you'll automatically reach more of your audience. Tip number four is to allocate ad budget for your best performing content. Now I know this is a video all about getting better organic reach. It's kind of counterintuitive, but it really works. You can amplify the organic reach with even a nominal budget and you'll see the reach of that post and your others will start to gain more traction, more reach and more engagement, even with a small amount of ad budget. And now for that bonus round I mentioned, I'm gonna share three things that will absolutely zap your organic reach on Facebook. Number one, don't even bother posting YouTube links. YouTube is Facebook's biggest competitor when it comes to video and the algorithms pick up that you've posted a YouTube video and you'll hardly get any reach. However, you might wanna test this one. I have a friend that has a page with about 25,000 fans and he recently got over half a million 
organic reach on a YouTube video. So sometimes you just never know and you have to test. Number two, avoid what Facebook calls engagement bait. And that is where you're trying to cause your audience to engage with you in an inauthentic manner. And Facebook actually listens to your video, including your live while you're broadcasting for any of those trigger words, things like comment below and please like, and please share. So think of other ways that you can do that. What are your thoughts? What do you think? How have you experienced this? Let us know your thoughts below. And number three, is avoid being completely off topic and irrelevant. You know your audience best and what they come to you for. So try not to stray too far from your brand messaging and your brand topics. So bottom line, to increase your organic reach, Facebook is looking for highly engaging content, specifically video posts and Facebook Live, one of my personal favorite ways to reach my audience. In the next video, I'm gonna show you exactly how I monetize my Facebook Live videos. We'll see you over there.